Hi guys, this is the Talon AD7200 router from TP-Link. Now this is the very first router on the market that supports the new 802.11 AD Wi-Fi standard or AD for short. And that means it's not going to be the only one. There will be soon other routers from other vendors supporting the same standard. But I bet that others will not have the same collapsible antennas like this. You can see. Take a look. I can do this all day. Not. Anyhow, it is a very fast Wi-Fi standard with the top speed of up to 7 gigabit per second. But it has many tiers. Now this router, for example, is supporting only up to 4.6 gigabit per second, but that's already crazy fast. There are two things though you should know. Number one. AD operates on the 60 GHz frequency band, and that means it has very short range. Now with this router, for example, it tops out at about 20-25 feet, and it cannot banish straight walls. So AD is only good for devices within close proximity with the router. And the second thing is, you know, to benefit from the AD speed, you need at least two clients sharing the same AD Wi-Fi standard. And that's hard because right now there are very few of them on the market. So few that even I has just one. This laptop right here. Now take a look. It's connecting to the router here right now at 2.3 gigabit per second. But there's nothing between the two actually require or even benefit a connection that fast. Now because of a short range, AD is not supposed to replace 802.11 AC. And that means the router here can also work as a regular AC router with a top speed on the 5 gigahertz frequency band of up to 1.7 gigabit per second and on the 2.4 gigabit band up to 800 megabit per second. Now obviously in real world usage, it will never have those numbers for many reasons. And this router here has a top sustained real world speed of some 550 megabit per second in my testing making it about the average among high-end routers. It has distant range to topping out about 160 feet away with a few walls in the middle. Obviously, at your home, you might see different results depending on how your home is shaped. The router here is quite easy to use and has similar features as other high-end routers such as VPN server, QoS, and even a good parental control. And it shares a similarly high price of about $320, so it's not a great deal, but not too bad deal either. And if you're excited about the new AD standard, well, it is the only choice on the market for now. So get it before there are more choices. No, seriously, get it if you have or plan to have a few AD clients at home. One thing though, make sure you have a place at home to put it, because seriously, it's huge, which is not a problem for me, because somehow I hear that all the time. Think about that though. Maybe that's because I'm Dong Ngo, and this is the Talon 8700 router from TP-Link.